we choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. We are here in Boston to visit this year's host of one of the world's most incredible environmental award ceremonies, the Earthshot Prize. The Earthshot Prize is the world's most ambitious and prestigious environmental prize, awarding five projects one million pound to further their efforts in protecting the Earth. The Earthshot Prize has been designed to find and scale the solutions that will help repair our planet within this decade, and focuses on five key categories, protect and restore nature, clean our air, revive our oceans, build a waste-free world, and fix our climate. In this video, we're showing you who's in the running for this year's prize and explain why the city of Boston has been chosen for this year's ceremony. The first annual Earthshot Prize was hosted by His Royal Highness Prince William in October of 2021 at the Alexandra Palace in London. Out of thousands of applicants, one incredible sustainable initiative in each of the five categories took home £1 million to accelerate the impact of their work. The winners included Takachar, an India-based company helping to eliminate rural air pollution caused by man-made agricultural fires for the Clean Our Air category. The Republic of Costa Rica for implementing bold conservation policies that benefit both the land and its people for the Protect and Restore Nature category. Coral Vita, the Bahamas-based coral restoration organization, helping to replant essential coral reefs around the world for the Protect and Restore Our Oceans category. The City of Milan's food waste hubs are helping fight food waste by collecting surplus food from supermarkets and cafeterias to be redistributed to the city's neediest citizens for the Build a Waste-Free World category. AEM electrolyzers by Enapta, machines turning renewable energy into green hydrogen, an emission-free gas that can be used to meet diverse energy needs for the Fix Our Climate category. In the year since the Earthshot Prize, each of these organizations has been able to further scale their companies and increase their global impact. There are some amazing candidates up for this year's Earthshot Prize, but before we tell you our favorites, let's dive into why the city of Boston was chosen for this year's ceremony. The Earthshot Prize was inspired by President John F. Kennedy's Moonshot. Issued on September 12, 1962, President Kennedy set the unprecedented goal of landing man on the moon within the decade and bringing them safely back to Earth. In July of 1969, the team at NASA accomplished the goal set out by JFK six years earlier, and the Apollo 11 mission successfully landed the first two humans on the moon. Sixty years on, Boston, the former president's home city, is now the domain of the John F. Kennedy Presidential Museum and Library. Situated overlooking the Boston Harbor, the museum and library was specially curated by JFK's wife, Jacqueline Kennedy to commemorate her former husband's moonshot legacy, as well as the other incredible work he did during his time in office, including promoting civil rights, establishing the Peace Corps, and mitigating conflict during the Cold War. According to President Kennedy's daughter, Ambassador Caroline Kennedy, there's no more important moonshot today than repairing the planet, and no better place to harness the moonshot spirit than the city of Boston. The ceremony will be a celebration showcasing the city of Boston, highlighting its global standing as a pioneer in innovation, as well as a top destination in environmental sustainability and investment. It will be a local, national, and global event all in one, and it has the power to catalyze change for a healthier planet. This year's 15 finalists have been selected from thousands of applicants worldwide and continue to tackle the problems that each Earthshot aims to solve. In the Fix Our Climate category, Oman-based company 44.01 captures carbon from the atmosphere and mineralizes it into rock. The US's Lanzatech is using bacteria to recycle carbon pollution into sustainable products and the UK's own low-carbon materials, or LCM, 
are turning unclean concrete production, which is responsible for over 2.8 billion tonnes of carbon emissions every year, into a green necessity for future construction. In the Build a Waste-Free World category, the city of Amsterdam has committed to having a circular economy by 2050. This means that absolutely nothing is wasted and everything is recycled. India-based company Fool is stopping both flower waste and pesticide pollution in the Ganges River through its creation of Fleather, an ethical and sustainable alternative to leather made from India's sacred flowers. Notpla, a UK-based company we had the fortune of visiting last year, is also nominated in this category for turning seaweed into alternatives for single-use plastic packaging, eliminating millions of pieces of plastic waste from entering landfills or our oceans. You can check out the full video we made on Notpla here. In the Protect and Restore Nature category, Professor Yi Chuzhen of China and his team have developed a way to turn barren desert into productive, farmable land at low cost and in a short amount of time, which is critical as more of the earth desertifies due to the climate crisis. In India, startup Katie's Greenhouse in a Box product is helping reduce small farmers' climate risk and increase their yields, regardless of extreme weather events. And finally, Malaysian Borneo-based research organisation Hutan is working to create a more peaceful coexistence between its unique endangered wildlife and its people. In the Revive Our Oceans category, the indigenous women of the Great Barrier Reef are working to empower each other to protect this critically endangered yet vital ecosystem. In Portugal, the team at Sea Forester are working to restore the world's essential kelp forests that not only offer food and shelter to marine wildlife, but also absorb even more carbon from the atmosphere than trees. And from the Netherlands, the Great Bubble Barrier intercepts plastic from smaller waterways before it reaches the ocean in a cost and space effective way. Finally, in the Clean Our Air category, two of the three nominees are based in Kenya. Rome is bringing affordable electric transport to East Africa to replace the highly polluting yet heavily relied on bodder bodders or motorcycle taxis. Across Africa, over 700 million people rely on traditional cook stoves which emit dangerous chemicals and lack safety features. Mukuru Clean Stoves is looking to change that, using processed biomass made from sugarcane, charcoal and wood to burn cleaner, cost less overall, and half ongoing fuel costs. In Hong Kong, China, the team at Amped Energy are helping to cut emissions caused by the construction industry with the Amped Entertainer, a compact all-electric battery energy storage system specifically designed to power construction sites without the need for fossil fuels. Each of these incredible inventions is changing the world and inspiring action across all sectors. In bringing global attention to these innovations, leaders, activists and initiatives, the Earthshot Prize is a world stage for potential investment in these companies and for continuing to drive forward the fight to save our world. To watch the Earthshot Prize ceremony on the 2nd of December, make sure to follow the details down below. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe down below. And stay tuned for more videos just like this. We'll see you in the next one.